Here we are in Boulder the day after the fires. Fire broke out south of Boulder just after 11 this morning. Since then, nearly 600 homes have been burned. Cars turning around on US 36 to escape the fast moving wildfire. It quickly grew out of control. It got real smoky. It's kind of hard to see, but this used to be a home. Now it is reduced to ashes. It's completely reduced to rubble. On the other side, it looks like a cliff. That's actually where the home used to be. Yet another home, hundreds just like this in a matter of hours. Does Alex has a hurt back? Always. Basically, everything's just falling apart. We're going to the store. It's supposed to snow for the next two days, so we got fire trucks coming through. Motor, we wear face masks. Go to camera, which is a GoPro kind of competitor. The uh, audio is not going to be great, but Abner, stop walking around, dog. The audio is not going to be great. You're going to make it worse. But in a controlled environment, it seems to be okay. So uh, I am here making a cheese quesadilla. Uh, Alex is at the hospital because D is back in the hospital, unfortunately. And um, yeah. The hits keep coming. She had to be rushed to the emergency room on New Year's Day. She's doing okay now. We're gonna have surgery on Thursday. Things are fucking crazy still. Um, yeah, that's the update. So it's just uh, me here tonight, Monday night, January 3rd. This is where we're at. I am gonna go to the mountains tomorrow. <laughs> So I got to Keystone really early this morning. It snowed. It snowed like nine inches last night. So it's going to be a good shred day finally. Today there's actually going to be some snow. I'm looking forward to it. Dee is having surgery today as well. So I'm not home. I can't do anything. So they, again, again, permission from Alex and her mom to come shred for a couple of days. Shredded a little yesterday. Conditions were just fucking crazy awful. Not a lot of fun. Took three runs, which, you know, technically is a day. A lot has happened. I say that every vlog, I've been saying it for years, but that's life, a lot is happening every day. I mean, if we really backtrack, if we really go back, the last vlog, which was like what, like I think it was a couple days after Christmas, right before the New Year's. Well, Boulder caught fire. Uh, that The night before I had taken my, or the day, two days before I had taken my Tesla to get serviced at a Tesla dealership that is no longer even really standing. So that's crazy. I literally picked it up within an hour or two of it burning.
Oh, it's beautiful out today, dude. The sky is actually blue. Today is Friday, so whew, it's early. Um, the sun is out. The sky is blue. It's incredible. It snowed like a motherfucker the last two days. We got over 10 inches. Yesterday was an insane powder day. Man, I got there before anybody. The lifts were delayed. You go up the first lift, you see all this fresh powder. You take your first run and you're like, oh my God. You know, like riding fresh powder is like, I don't know. It's like a, another dimension of life. Ugh, that does not exist anywhere else on the planet. So it's just, I don't know, you're just floating. Even though you're on a fucking resort, I wish I wasn't. I wish I'd just take a helicopter to the top and not see another person. But um, it is very, it's like a nice sense of freedom, even though you just paid thousands of dollars to be there. But regardless, Alex's mom's surgery was yesterday. She's doing great. She's just in the hospital still recovering. We're able to bring her dog, Fiona. You guys haven't met Fiona yet. I came up here for like three days just to kind of get away and shred and i'm working on a new look book finally we're kind of getting stuff back in order um, my tattoo schedule is completely clear i'm not taking any tattoos for right now i'm leaving blue hair in full time but i'm still gonna come up and guest spot yeah so up here gonna hit copper mountain today i'm gonna come back here i'm gonna clean i'm gonna pack up me and alex's ski shit and then go home and uh, get back to work on our new life and go skiing with Alex hopefully at Eldora which is where her dad was killed I'm pretty sure her first day back is gonna be Eldora I think that's what she wants to do that's the morning update there's not much else not much else My goodness. That's crazy. <laughs> Been cleaning out this basement all well. Six six weeks, seven weeks now. How long have we been cleaning out this basement? A long time. My dad died five weeks ago. You're in the dark. It's gonna be very mooted if we do this in the dark. Let me <laughs> it's like, are you afraid of the dark? Way to have it. Five weeks ago, five and a half weeks ago. Way to have a sense of humor, though. Yeah, it's been fucking crazy. My mom is wackadoo. Well, clarify what you mean by wackadoo. Sick. She's ill. Ill. She has autoimmune diseases, and she gets infected. And the, the first... stuffed animals are gonna be uh, really creepy. A story for another time. Come close. <laughs> look. Oh shit! Look at the fucking Reaper troll. This is dark. This is your first appearance back on the vlog, and you're just, it does match your shirt. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> it was the, <laughs> we both, you saw my face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't even think, I'm like, oh, that shirt. Your tears, they don't fall, they pour down on me. I think that's it. <laughs> started acting kind of weird like she wasn't making sense yeah and she had a fever and then i was like we gotta go to the er she's like fuck you alex i gotta go <laughs> she was like, gonna drag her out of the house they had to keep her there for four days she had to get a large portion of her foot removed you look at the x-ray it looks like it's been exploded or like maybe an elephant stepped on it but what's happened is the infection has just eaten it away so they need to not only remove that part the infection part they need to remove 
past that to make sure they got all <clears throat> This is what we've been dealing with. You just came home yesterday. <clears throat> yeah. Did a doll collector? I came back down the mountain yesterday. We don't need to get into the dolls right now. What are you going to talk about the dolls? What are you going to say? She's a doll collector, record collector, music collector, <laughs> Christmas ornament collector. There's a lot of stuff. Look, there's a lot of stuff. There's a vastly organized version. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff we have um, to go through. But I, we've been living out, this is what we've been living out of. This is our closet the last six weeks. Yeah. Literally, this is all. It's true. I mean, Teddy and I, he might have a couple sweatshirts, I think, and jackets. Of course, the Arcteryx are hanging out. Alex, yeah, Arcteryx is safe. We bought a new filter today. We got fish. We got Louie. Lucifer. The angel fish. Lucifer Lily. the angel fish. Have we named the other guys? That's our Plico. Oh, yeah. Our leopard sailfin. Oh, yeah. And then over there is also the catfish. In this oh, this guy's cool. What do they call him? A bristle nose Plico? I don't remember. It's kind of like being in an antique store, honestly. We have this pool table that we need to get rid of. Listen, <clears throat> if you're trying to come get a custom pool table, holler at me. It's nice. We got a Lisa bed. It wasn't free. We didn't have time to try influencer marketing. We just needed a bed. Fun fact, we've been sleeping on Alex's childhood bed. Yes, that is right, ladies and gentlemen. Sometimes with Omar. Not it only has been... is it cozy, but it is old. Uh, Both of our beds. Our childhood bed. Better. How creepy. How creepy is that? It's another night of organizing. What's today's date? The Hard, 8th. The 8th. Hard to keep up. We're going to go shred soon. We brought Alex's skis down. That's the plan. All right, check in when we check in, who knows? <laughs> Listen. <laughs>